Let's talk about Judy's Magic Cast On. This is a great way to start toe up socks, although it has other uses too. Um, if you wanted to cast on a sweater uh, button band in the middle of the back neck, this would be a good way to do it. So to start with, you're gonna do um, just kind of like the um, long tail cast on, except you're going to use the tail in the back and the uh, working yarn is gonna be in the front. So you need to start with a needle that you're gonna twist the yarn around. So I'm not doing a slip knot for this, I'm just doing a twist. And then, that's gonna be the back needle. Then you need a second needle to put in the front. So you have your two needles, you're doing a long tail cast on, except the tail is in the back and the working yarn's in the front. So hold the tail on your index finger, the working yarn on your thumb, and then you're going to alternate loading the stitches up. So to get a stitch on the front needle, you take the yarn from your index finger, wrap it around and through the middle. And you want these stitches to be pretty tight. Um, to get a stitch on the back needle, take the yarn off your thumb, oops, bring it through the middle and then over the top. So you go around the bottom and through the middle with your index finger and then through the middle and over the top. Bottom to the middle, middle to the top. Bottom to the middle, middle to the top. Bottom to the middle, middle to the top bottom to the middle. All right, so now we have some stitches on our needles here. We have two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve stitches. Okay, so let's talk about how to start that first round. It's a little tricky for a couple rounds. See, which to uh, start my, my actual knitting, I'm going to turn the needles around and you'll notice that my back needle now is going to become my bottom needle. And um, I'm going to start knitting from what was my front needle. So this is actually the last stitch I cast on. You'll notice that there's not really anything holding it into place. It's just kind of flopping around there, and that's normal. You'll, it, it'll just be like that for the first round. So you have to kind of hold it in place by pulling on the tail. And then you're going to start knitting, kind of cock this bottom needle to the side. After you pull the first stitch through, give a little tug on the tail, and that will tighten things up. And then you're going to continue knitting off the first needle, which used to be your front needle. Sorry, my neighbor's doing a little home improvement. <laughs> and then to start your second needle, cock that first needle out of the way and knit the stitches off of the second needle. And that will finish up your first round. Whoops. And you'll have a little patch of knitting that looks like that. Um, so your second round will be an increase round. And then your third round is usually a plain round. And the fourth round is increase. So that's how you start your toe-up socks.